Okay, time for number three, and I know a lot of people have been wondering about this. The answer is Josie Altador, Toronto FC striker. Oh boy, oh boy, where do we start here? Lots of areas, I think, but it's clear for me at the end, you've got to go to the final. The one yeah. big goal that he scored, he obviously scored the goal against Columbus as well. But in the big moments, Josie Altador has delivered for TFC. Yeah, he certainly has. And I've watched that goal so many times and it's, it's, it's so perfect. The way that he takes it, his touches, his finish. And uh, yeah, this list is about moments. This list is about uh, inspiration. And, and he's one of the guys, he's, he's a player for the, the, the big games. He finds his mentality, he lifts himself to their levels. He's, he's been part of, uh, you know, great teams, but he's someone who can can do the, the big things at the big times. Yeah, one of my favourite performances by Josie Alstor that I have watched a lot is against Philadelphia, the very first playoff win yeah. game when he was absolutely unplayable in that game. Unplayable. The tempo that he set right from the start, the presence that he had, ability to score the goal, man of the match performance, and that was their first playoff victory. In fact, his record during that time, they played 23 games in 2016, 17 and 18. That was either an MLS playoff game, a Canadian Championship final, or a CONCACAF Champions League game. And he scored 14 goals in those yeah. 23 games. It's like, remarkable, isn't yeah. it? It really is. And and and, and that is a, a great strength as well, to, to lift your game, especially when you're playing at that level, right. you know, to find that extra few percent that, that only the, the best can do. And he's one of the best, you know. No and I, I know he had the pieces round about him, but I think that he was a, a real leader through his performances in their games and someone who, when he's he's got that, that, that dominant style of his and when he's, when he's in that mindset, He's almost impossible to mark, KG. I agree. A massive presence for Toronto FC. The other thing I would say this is that everybody who loved playing around him, who, who had what I would call quick football brains, Vasquez, yeah. Pozuelo now as well, they all loved playing with Altidore. Mm -hmm. Javinko loved playing yeah. with Altidore. And Altidore actually has that brain too. He talked about it when he went to Villarreal and he, le and he learned from the likes of Santi Cazorla and that quick Spanish thinking La Liga kind of brain. And he has that and that has helped him develop as a striker. He's a very good football player. You know, you see his size, you think he's, he's someone who, you know, sort of holds the ball up and that, but he's a very good football he player. He's got terrific feet and that's why the guys love him because he, t he takes a lot of that physical side away from what they need to do to provide space for them. But he can play in the tight areas as well. And uh, yeah... One, one guy who's admired greatly by his teammates yeah. as well and uh, leads them in many ways. Fantastic stuff. Number three, Toronto FC, Josie Altidore. Welcome to the best list brought to you by Best Athletes, helping youth soccer players develop and get recruited and helping coaches build better athletes and teams. 